Today we'll see how to pick one number between given range of numbers and also we'll see how to generate OTP and CAPTCHA in Oracle. Let us discuss one by one. Oracle provided one predefined package that is DBMS underscore random. By using this package, we can able to generate a random value, a random string. This is the syntax. In DBMS random, a value is one function which is used to generate any random number. So if you want to start anything, start with select star from DL because it has only one column and one value. We can perform any operation on this table like addition, subtraction, multiplication and so on. Our requirement is that we need to pick one number. Our requirement is that to pick one number between given range of numbers. So Oracle provided one package like tbms underscore random dot value is one function which accept two arguments. So every time we execute, we'll get new value. So we don't want the decimal point. So in order to remove the decimal point, we'll make use of trunk function. So every time we'll get new value. We'll, we'll put one alias name. Next topic is OTP generation in Oracle. As we all aware that for each and every transaction, OTP is required. By using DBMS underscore random package, we can able to generate the OTP. Let us see how we can able to achieve this thing. As we all aware that OTP is a six digit character, the numbering start with one lakh and end with six nines. So between the given range, we need to generate one number. We don't want the decimal points, we'll truncate that value by using trunk function. We'll put one alias name for it. So required OTP can be achieved. Next topic is capture generation in Oracle. It can also be achieved by using dbms underscore random package. Let us see how it can be achieved. In dbms random package, we have one function that is string. By using this function, we can able to generate capture value. Here u represents uppercase value and 6 represents number of characters we need to be generated. We will put one alias name. Every time we are generated, random characters will be generated. So if you want lowercase, we need to replace with L. If you want mixed case, we need to put as A. If you want any numbers to be printed, like alphanumeric, by using X, we can able to achieve this one. If any printable characters need to be printed, like special characters, combination of alphanumeric and special characters, P should be replaced.
based on your requirement we need to replace the uh, type of characters and number of digits to be generated and to learn our new to pls skill take this topic as a challenge and try to create one otp authentication package in this package create one functional processor as your choice that is otp generation in this function we need to generate otp and create one more function that is otp validation function in this function we need to validate whether the generated value is equal to user entered value if it matches then it is success if it is not matches we need to throw error and we need to put one more condition like the generated otp value and the user entered otp value should be less than 60 seconds if the user enter more than uh, 60 seconds then we need to say as it is otp is invalid if you try to able to achieve these things the coding skills and logical skills can be improved by using this topic for practice make use of this url in this we can able to pack create package compile and execute the package if you like the content subscribe and share the channel thank you for watching